Hey guys, welcome to another video. So, I thought I'd show you something new that I've uh, run into. Um, it's Star Citizen. Here's my ship that I've got at the moment. The Origin 315P. Um, so I think we'll go down and have a look at it. But, um, this game's still in, well, pre-alpha, I'd say. I should probably get my details right on that, but uh, I'm pretty sure it's pre-alpha. Um, and it's like been kick-started for a long time. Um, and they're still making progress on it all the time, and bits are coming out all the time, so... But uh, this is my ship at the moment. So, you can see, it's got some guns on there. Sort of a... Uh, definitely very aircraft-like, isn't it? So, even though it's meant for outer space, obviously. But, um... Yeah, this game's uh, sort of a space simulator type thing. And at the moment, it's just a few things unlocked. Uh, basically, this is your hangar. So you get a hangar. Uh, a big old space to store, store your ships. There's a few pieces over there, which I'll probably show you in a little while. Um, and then you can have a look around your ship, obviously. Um, we can go into it like this. It's all very flash, like that, very smooth. See? I'll just uh, show you me. You don't get to pick your own profile yet, or nowhere that I've found anyway, but, um, you know, all works quite well. Do a bit of strafing, and, you know, it, uh, it just looks very nice. So, um, And they always seem to be improving the game today. Every time I come on this and try a little bit more, always improving the gameplay a little bit more so yeah this is a uh, can open up this side as well there we go gets into a nice little uh, open section here Ooh, almost falling out oh I can walk out on the wing I don't think I ever used to be able to do that before what's new can I get back in though Am I stuck on the outside of the ship? Yes, looks like I am. I gotta climb up the ladder. Damn. But yeah. Everything now is very flash. I just like how you've got this first person view and everything is just like you're there. Very immersive gameplay, I think. This is gonna be very immersive. All the controls work, or seem to so far, or look like they work anyway. You know, all these buttons and screens and and everything. But yeah, I can take you into a bit of a flight at the moment. So yeah, it's sort of in patches with this uh, ar arena commander gives you different things to do. So um, we'll go to drone sim. Um, and I think we'll show you a bit of free flight. Um, and just around this broken moon, that seems to be the first one, really. So we'll just launch that up. And I'll be back in two secs when that's loaded up. And we're back. So we're all loaded in now. In space, in the ship. It doesn't give you any cinematics yet of you sort of launching into space or anything, but... Uh, at the moment, I'm still getting used to controls. I haven't played it too much yet. But uh, basically, I'm used to using mouse and keyboard right now. A yeah, very picturesque view of the planet there and this asteroid field, obviously, that we're around. And God knows what these things are that are, I don't know, blasting down something towards the light by the looks of it. I assume you'd be lifting stuff up. Hmm. Too sure what they are, but uh, going from there. If anybody knows, they can always put it in the comments. So, there's the outside of the ship. Looks very nice and smooth. So, you can see from different angles. There's the front. See me as the pilot. What I'd also quite like is. Um, you can see me moving sometimes, which I quite like. See the arms moving back and forth. I like that, side to side. I 
this courtyard, I think. Down. And we're back in the uh, first person view there. So let's have a little bit of a fly around. See, it's, uh, it's quite good. Spin. And you see when the screen goes grey like that? Kind of means you're blacking out a little bit, obviously taking on too many Gs. So, obviously you have to be wet. You're mindful of that when you're flying around and obviously in combat. Pulling too tight a turn and you're going to black out and be a sitting duck there for the enemy. So, got to sort that out at some point and sort out my flying skills. But it's only going to come with practice. But you can see on the HUD there, we're doing about I don't know, it's miles per second, meters per second. Sorry. So we're doing about 220 just onto it, you know, just in a straight line. You come around, and it moves you around and things like that. So come around like that. You see all the little thrusters lighting up and, and doing what they should do and everything works as it should, you know, so it's it's, it's very nice for that. You see the thrusters there on the front? So, and it just looks so awesome, I think. So, right, well, I think we'll um, go and load up another scenario, maybe go to the racing section and I'll show you some of the racing scenes. Okay, so I'll see you back in two secs. So, I thought I'd just show you some of the modes that we've got at the moment. Um, so, you got free flight, obviously. Uh, then you've got this Vandal Swarm. Uh, hold off an overwhelming Vandal onslaught led by several infamous ace pilots. UEE ships are in limited supply, so excessive casualties will result in defeat. So, yeah, we're going to have to have a go at that at some point. Maybe not in this video, but definitely another video. And um, then you have the classic race. Um, where it's pure racing. Push your ship to its limit and be the first across the finish line. So there we go. That's actually on the uh, on a home world by the looks of it. So, and then there's always just the free flight. And that's all the maps you get. So Dying Star as well. You can go around and uh, do a bit of free flight, or the Vandul Swarm, which can happen at both Broken Moon and Dying Star. So that's quite interesting, but the raceway can only be done. Oh no, there is two two race courses. So is that three race courses? Sorry, three race courses there. So you've got Old Van der Vel, Rickford Memorial Raceway, and the Defford Link. So yeah, we'll definitely have to go through some of those. But um, yeah, should we try this one? I think just to show you, just to show you what it's like in this video. There we go. Right, I'll be back in a few seconds when that's loaded up. And we're back, so we're all loaded in and uh, almost ready to race. Now, I've only done this once before and I wasn't very good. I've only done sort of one lap, so this really is my sort of almost first fresh look at this. So, But um, one thing I did notice is you can barely see right in the middle of the screen where it says press X when ready, which uh, took me a few seconds to find. So, But um, it's just me in this. Uh, I'm not racing against anybody else. It's kind of just free flight on this race course just to Three, learn the course. So, two, counting one, down. Go. And off we go. So basically, it's laid out this course for you around here. And we just have to uh, take some nice pictures of you as you're going around. Go around and go through these. So here we go. Let's see if I can do this without crushing. No, there we go. See if that's crush already. I don't even know what I crashed into there. Is that just a camera or something that I crashed into? Oh my god, it's put me right back over here. There we go. Alright, let's try again. Let's just go. So I'm not going full speed yet because I'm really not very confident on this. Oh my god. You know, I might have to get the old flight stick out for this. 
practice, I'm just not that confident yet with these controls. <laughs> here we go. Just take it nice and steady around here. Nice and steady. And then of course, so sweeping round over to here. Oh, I always forget we can strafe as well. See, I'm taking pretty pictures of you. Here we go, speed up a bit. There's the next one. I forget what the next one is. Around here somewhere, I believe. Up here? Oh my god. down here somewhere oh there it is that's not our next one we've missed one out somewhere I missed one Wrong direction. damn it oh well we'll have to go back is that it then? Wrong direction. is that the one we missed see now it's going to tell us off we're going the wrong way it's like speed cameras. It's not like speed cameras. Oh, how did we miss that? It's there. Just there. Four. Uh, oh, well. Try and remember that for next time. But yeah, I can see this being very difficult. Especially when you've got a lot of other guys you're racing against. And, uh, yeah, I can see this being very difficult. Checkpoint. thrusters just take you off and literally just yeah take you off to different directions and it is quite hard to control. Let's see, oh, are we gonna do this? Just about. Oh, we didn't like it though. We didn't like it. There we go. Up here we go. Oh, it's just there. Let's see, tucked around all this. Very dangerous race course this. I think we need to complain to somebody. There it is. There's the next one. Oh, come on! We hit the rim. Damn. Which way are we going? Oh, we're going that way. See, there's lump posts and beams and everything coming out there. I presume they'll kill you if you touch them. See, now this is coming up to where I, I've crushed loads on my previous run. Just trying to get a straight run through here. Nigh on impossible for me. Ah, see. Told you. See. Just can't get through there. I'm next time. I'm going to have to dig out the flight stick. And hopefully that will do it. What do we even get for that? down. Get down. Oh. Well, somehow, we didn't blow up. Don't ask me how, but we didn't. Right to this one. Straight round a bit. And punch it. Come on. It's the slide. Everything slides. I suppose it's a bit like just drifting. You are drifting around this course. No big spaceship. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna but not bore you, and I'm gonna take you back to the hangar. And we'll see a few more things, and then that'll probably be it for this video. Right, I'll see you back at the hangar. So we're back in the hangar. Oh, didn't want to do that. I want to get out. There we go. So we'll get out, and I'll just show you a couple of other little things, and uh, that'll probably be it. And then um, it's 
suppose we'll uh, next video we'll have some proper fights maybe against some other people but uh, I think I need a bit more practice before I do that so you know it's all locked up you've got to get yourself out for it to open up down we get does it get do I have to use the ladder or do I just jump out oh no I can there we go walk me out nice rather than just jumping out even though you could do that oh he did kind of jump out anyway ah well Shift to run everywhere in this game. Nice and easy. I obviously need a few more ships because I've got a massive hangar for this. And this is one of the ships they're promoting at the moment. The Mustang looks very nice. Might see. Might see about giving that. Now, you can pay real money for all these ships right now. You know, to sort of back the game and, and get into it like this early access. But uh, all these ships will be free in game when uh, when the game is actually released so um, you know I didn't want to put any real money in you don't have to so we need to kind of lift this look this lift action lift away. everything just works nice and smooth so where we go right, if I went over to that lift up there the lift just automatically knows just to come up over there just to the left of the ship yeah. doors here you can't go through any of them yet um, doesn't seem to be anything there but uh, go down here uh, you've sort of got a main platform here which I presume at some point you'll be able to do something maybe it's just a viewing platform I'm not sure but try out weird things and um, you've got this little thing here send you to plentiful salvage. Happy New Year! And lights up a little ship. There we go. Looking at something, salvaging something. There we go. So, so we've got everything over that way. Um, just one more thing, I suppose, I'll just show you just before I go. Get down here. Just this little console panel just in front of me, just here. Oh, the ship comes down. It doesn't need them. So. Yeah, there we go. And this little console panel that you can hit. Have all these ships on there by the looks of it. Paints, or designs, weapons, ammo for all the different in game things. It looks like there's to be a way to choose something else there, but I ain't quite worked that out yet, but I will. And uh, as soon as I do, I'll show you. It's quite quiet. It darkens all the lights and everything like that. Makes it very cinematic. Anyway, guys, that'll do for this video. Please subscribe and like if you uh, indeed did, or uh, post me some comments. Let me know what you'd like to see more of. And uh, I'll see you again. Thank you very much. Bye for now.